Hello friends and welcome back. In this lecture, we will be configuring our Java development environment. Here is our outline. So we will install our JDK and right now the latest version is 13.0.1. Then we will set up the environment variables and finally we will install IntelliJ IDEA which is the IDE that we will use in this course. So first of all, we need to download the setup files for IntelliJ and the JDK. So let's do that. First of all, go to your internet browser and search for IntelliJ IDEA download. After that, go to the first result. And here is the download page. Choose your operating system and you want to download the community edition, which is free. So press on the download button and the download will start. Now we want to download JDK. So search for JDK download and go to the first result. Now as you can see over here, Java SE 13.0.1. Press on the download button and scroll down a little bit. In this panel, we have to accept the license agreement and now we can download JDK for our operating system. And this is it. So after we download the files, we want to install JDK. So now we have the file, double click on it and this window will open. Press on next and you will see this window. Note that this path over here is important. Keep it as it is and press on next. Then this window will appear saying that the installation was successful. Now press close and this is it. Now we want to set up the environment variables. So basically we want to let our computer know where to find JDK so that we are able to develop Java programs. So let's do that. Open this PC and go to properties or on the left side, right click and go to properties. This window will open. Press on advanced system settings and you will see this. Now over here, press on environment variables. Under the system variables, we want to press new. In the variable name, type java underscore home, exactly like this. Now the value, we will get the installation path of our JDK. So C, program files, Java, and here is our JDK. So copy this path, you can right click and press copy or use Ctrl C. Now back in our value, press Ctrl V or right click and paste. Now press OK and now you will see that we have this variable ready. Perfect. Now I want you to search for a variable called path like this. Select it and press edit and want to press new. So over here, I want you to type this Java underscore home backslash bin exactly like this. So here it is. And now just press OK. And this is it. Press OK again. And after that, press OK. Now to make sure that everything is working, go to your start and search for CMD and open this application. Over here, type Java dash version, just like this and press enter. And you should see this message. And this indicates that Java is installed and you are ready to start creating our Java programs. So now we want to install IntelliJ IDEA. So we have the setup, double click on it and this window will open. Press next and you will see this. Simply press next and if you want, you can create a desktop shortcut. Okay? And after that, press next and install. After the installation is finished, you will see this window. So press finish and do not run IntelliJ. We will use it later. So this is it. Congratulations. You are now ready to start developing Java programs and I'll see you in the next video.